Let's take a look at question number 129 on the DS section of GMAT Official Guide 2015. We want to find the point on or less than 2x plus 3y equal to 6, which means the question is asking whether 2r plus 3s is going to be less than or equal to 6. We have two variables, r and s. And to match the number of variables, we need two equations. Conditions 1 and 2 is each going to give us one equation. And we expect C to be our answer. Let's consider conditions 1 and 2 together and see if that's the case. First of all, pictorially, what's the question asking? It's asking us because this line is 2r plus 3s equals 6. Whether that's equal to or less than 6, we're looking for this area here. We want to know if the point rs is in that region. What about the conditions 1 and 2 set together? First, that's 3r plus 2s equals 6, just like before. And then we have a horizontal line, s is equal to 2, vertical line, r is equal to 3, but it has to be less than those two. So that's the area according to both conditions 1 and 2. Okay, But in working with inequalities and problems, we have to remember that if the questions range includes the conditions range, then the condition is sufficient. Okay? What about our case? When we do conditions 1 and 2 together, our condition is not inside the question's range. So E is our answer. 